cold right now. This morning, it's nice that we have a calm day ahead and some mild temperatures to look forward to as well, Michelle. Yeah, and just not one day, but we have several lined up for the rest yeah. of this week and through the weekend. Let's go ahead and take a look at the conditions outside right now. It'll be a pretty sunrise as we see a mixture of clouds and some pre-dawn glow here in Narragansett. Sun's up at about a quarter past the hour at 7 o'clock. East Providence starting off dry and with good visibility from the top of our Kettle Point camera looking at the city of Providence. It's 33 degrees northwest winds at 7 miles per hour this morning and the radar has been quiet for the majority of our area. A couple of flurries still over a far eastern mass. Plymouth, Cape Cod has seen some sprinkles and some flurries, but that all will dry up too. So a quiet stretch leading our three key things that cool weekend follows. Are there any storms in store? Well, we've got one passing well south of us on Saturday. That one's a miss. There could be another coastal storm though uh, on Tuesday or Wednesday of next week. So that's the next day, the days that we're uh, going to be really eyeing for any potential unsettled weather. Our temperatures right now, upper 20s to lower 30s. Providence 33, 31 in Westerly and 32 New Bedford. While Smith feels a little cooler, upper 20s for the temperature, but you've added in the winds, it feels around 21 degrees. So grab your warm coat again for this morning. We end up with warmer than average temperatures this afternoon. A winds will be at about 5 to 10 miles per hour, but some occasional gusts 15 possible. And so we'll see that into the morning and midday hours. Light winds expected overnight tonight and under clear skies. It'll be cooler tonight than what we've seen the last few nights. So clouds clearing out, turning mostly sunny today, about 43 degrees for your afternoon high. And as we get into the uh, forecast here, noontime, I expect us to be in the upper 30s to low 40s. Skies are sunny this afternoon and the temperatures about five, six degrees warmer than normal. So low Lower 40s, Providence, New Bedford, and Newport. Could even see a few spots hit the mid 40s. 5 o'clock this evening, back falling through the 30s. 35 Smithfield, 37 Providence, and then late tonight, again, I expect us into the 20s. What does it feel like today? Well, with the winds, so it'll, wind chill will be climbing to the middle 30s. Overnight tonight, dropping down to about 27 degrees, and in some spots may even be a few degrees cooler than that at about 25 in the capital city. Live satellite and radar this morning still showing the counterclockwise flow around that area of low pressure that's been hanging around all week. That continues to move away. High pressure builds in, and a storm system over the southern U.S. will bring accumulating snow to parts of western North Carolina and Tennessee. That one is going to be a miss for us. It stays to the south. Low pressure passing by Saturday will just deliver some cooler temperatures and a few high clouds. In the seven day forecast, we are storm free all the way through at least Monday. The temperatures uh, pretty much near normal or slightly above it too. mid to upper 30s on Saturday. Sunday's highs in the upper 30s. Monday looks dry. You know, not a lot that we're going to see any precipitation from the system midweek next week, but we'll be keeping an eye on the track of it. If it comes close enough to us like this European model shows, we could get some rain or snow. A lot of our other computer models have it far enough away that we'll continue with the dry stretch. 